everyone, my name is Caroline and I am your Spring 2015 president. For a lot of us, spring means the end of something, whether or not it's the end of your freshman year or your job searches. For me, spring means the end of my ABA journey and I would really like to take the time to sort of reflect upon what has happened throughout my journey and really give you some words of wisdom that has helped me through it. First, keep an open mind. When I first came to Berkeley, I didn't really have an idea of what I wanted to do. I knew that I wanted to become a lawyer, but law school seemed so far off that it didn't seem like something I could really explore as an undergrad. Although I talked to my roommate several times about how she intended to apply to Haas, I remember thinking that the business community was so far removed from me that it didn't really even enter my mind to pursue something in business until I spontaneously decided to join ABA the next semester. Now I can say that ABA has definitely been the largest growing experience for me, and this is coming from someone who heavily prizes personal growth. In ABA, you will meet people of all sorts, face challenges that are unexpected, and come across opportunities that open a new path. Don't be afraid of change, and take that path if you think you can grow from it. You won't regret it. Next, chase after your passions and focus on the relationships that you have with others. You want to live a life with integrity and pride, so don't be afraid to go after what you love. The reason why I lump these two together is because the journey can be tough at times, and you might be discouraged from pursuing your interests. That's where your friends come in. There have been times when I felt tempted to fall into the narrative of self-perpetuating, self-pitying loneliness, and blaming myself for everything that went wrong. But the reality is, I was never alone. And likewise, you are never alone. It is through the guidance and support of my friends that I have made it this far with the desire to give back to the community. Develop that trust and cherish your bonds. Lastly, have courage. If there is a defining theme of my journey, it is that people are stronger than they usually give themselves credit for. Have I been afraid? Definitely. But the desire to become a better person than I was yesterday has always driven me to overcome adversary, no matter how difficult it may be. Don't look backwards where what has been done has been done, but towards the future, where the rest of your life is. Where there's a will, there's a way. Thank you for listening to the ramblings of a naively idealistic girl, but more importantly, thank you so much for giving me this precious opportunity to lead all of you and leave behind this legacy. All of you have given me so much, and I can only hope that I have done the same for you. If there's one message that I could leave behind as president or one key takeaway is that the future is truly yours to shape. And with that, I thank you and it has been an honor serving as your Spring 2015 president.